hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel is your baby girl mama what's up in today's video i'm going to show you how i prepare this delicious catfish pepe soup if you want to know how i achieve it stay tuned to the end of this video guys to begin i will start by washing the catfish and i'm gonna be using some warm water and some lime to wash the catfish yes guys i just removed the catfish from the freezer as you can see it's still blocked normally i supposed to soak the catfish inside hot water but you can see the catfish is quite big so as for me it doesn't matter because i'm using hot water to wash the fish so so guys this is the lime i'm gonna use to wash the catfish yeah guys so before i forget if you are watching me for the first time thank you so much for clicking on this video please let's be friends by smashing that sign that says subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out whenever i upload new videos yeah i normally upload videos on weekly basis and my channel is all about cooking lifestyle hairstyle talk videos if i also see anything that caught my attention trust me i can as well film it so feel free to join this channel yeah if you love what i do it's a way of helping me to grow and if you're my OG returning subscribers, I see you. Thank you so much. God bless you for always tuning in, for always watching my video. Yeah, I really appreciate you guys. And if you're my new subscriber, please don't forget to check out my other videos. At the end part of these videos, there will be an end stream that will pop out. Please do where to check it out. You can also go through my channel. I have a lot of interesting video you may find interesting. Yeah. So continue watching and I hope you will enjoy watching this video as much as I do filming it for you guys. Yeah. I'm just trying to make sure the fish is well clean. Take note, you must wash your fish very well because to prepare pepe soup is an easy thing, but to wash the fish is where the work lies. Honestly, guys, especially catfish. Yeah, you need a lot of work to wash it to make sure that it's clean. All those drawing stuff inside, that is why you see people use lime or lemon to make sure that they wash it very well. Take note if you are making your catfish or any fish at all, it's always advisable to use lemon or lime to wash it. Yeah. So keep watching, guys. There's not much to do when all I can is thinking about you, not doing well. Don't know where you are, cause you're not here. So right now guys, I'm done washing the catfish. The next is to slice it to the size I need. so guys take note don't forget to clean up the head yeah it's very important all those things that is inside the head parts make sure you clean it up with lime and remove all those nyama nyama all those rubbish yeah so it's always very important please A few 
moments later so now i'm done washing the fish the fish is clean well clean well washed yeah the next thing you have to do is to add water according to the quantity of the pepper soup you want to make then start adding the yam you are using to make your own pepper soup if you are using yam next is to add my scent leaf and i mix three types of leaves the scent leaf ozoza and otaze yeah guys and next is to add your pepper soup spice so i use fresh one and blended one at the same time i added some crayfish just add all your ingredients at this moment i added everything at once and start cooking it so right now i'm done blending it i just add in the blended crayfish with uh, ozoza seed and I added a little bit of maggi seasoning cubes, add your salt, then I now added grinded pepper soup spice, already mixed. Yes, guys. Take note, guys, you can also make your pepper soup without adding yam. Yam is optional. Some people, they add yam or potatoes or unripe plantain. It depends on what you want to prepare it with. Yeah, it doesn't matter now i just added my red chili pepper the next one is to add my pepper soup spice you can see it yeah this one is already made pepper soup spice you can also get it in african shop or in nigeria in africa yeah so i'll just add all the ingredients i need to add at this moment and just cover it and allow it to cook a few moments later so right now guys we are going to be checking the pepper soup yeah it has been boiling for 10 minutes right now and i ended up cooking it for 15 minutes yes guys and the smell coming out of this pepper soup is something else honestly guys if you've not tried this recipe give it a try a trial will convince you yeah the taste is awesome and you can see how delicious is looking the taste is sugary lekker and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed watching the video yeah so guys right now is 15 minutes and we are gonna be dishing it out is ready yeah so guys i believe i've come to the end of this video thank you so much for watching this video you can also enjoy this pepper soup with some glass of wine beer champagne name it all especially now we are in holidays period and it's cold the weather is very cold we are in winter yeah so guys see you all in my next upcoming video because as of now i am out ciao bye